It's been six months since Abby's accident where she was badly burnt and her life changed forever. The fire just lit up and it shot across the room and it, it instantly caught my hair and it, it then caught my clothes. Just remember being in such panic and thinking how can I get myself out of this situation. I have to moisturise four times a day. I basically just have to use circular motions and keep all of my scars hydrated. And after I do that, I use my silicone sheets and then I put my compression vest on, which I wear for 23 hours a day. There are very bad days and there are very, very low lows and it makes me feel very upset. Some days I just sit inside and I cry all day and I look at myself in the mirror and if I'm not happy with what I'm wearing, I do just end up crying and would just get back into bed because I felt I wasn't ready, I wasn't ready for the world to see me. And I feel like I'm, I'm less fun now because I'm always just aware of everything around me. I definitely am very anxious and there are times where I do think, oh my God, my heart's beating so fast. So it is a whirlwind of emotions, that's for sure. My mum was trying to hold in her tears as much as possible. For them, it's been just as hard, I think, and wonder why and when it's going to be over. Abby is still really early on in her own journey, but I hope by bringing her here today to meet some awesome burn thrivers, it will encourage her to start to feel the same way too. So I've brought you here to Hillingdon Lido, and I thought we could hang out with them today. Amazing, I'm excited. This Girl. is Rochelle and this is Sylvia. Hi. Both of you are a great example of people that have been on a journey of acceptance to the point where you celebrate the skin that you're in. I've pretty much lived with burns all my life. I was unfortunately in the care of my childminder at eight months old and she tripped over me with a kettle literally scalded from the head all the way down. It hasn't been easy growing up in a society that expects perfection to be scar free so it really taught me that I need to live as an example. I took part in a beauty pageant which was the first time I'd ever worn a bikini at 27. <laughs> I feel like uplifted talking about it because it's such a positive thing. It was just through a game of hide and seek with my sister that I fell into a bowl of boiling water. They literally told my parents that I wouldn't survive. When I hit my teens, realising that my body isn't accepted, I suffered with PTSD, I began to um, abuse with alcohol, just felt like I was so trapped. I was on holiday with my mum and this guy was videoing me and I thought, you know what, I don't like this. I can see my mum is so upset and I can't hurt my mum. It was just through that my mindset changed. I'm embracing my body now, I'm happy to live with this body. What kind of advice would both of you give Abby? Every day, try and look in the mirror and just remind yourself of all the amazing, wonderful things that you have to offer. This is your purpose now, and your purpose is your power. Honestly, I feel so emotional <laughs> with you guys. You're just so inspirational to me. Your trauma's very raw. It's okay to be you and to be beautiful you, because you are. Thank you. <laughs> well, would you be up for um, putting on your swimsuit today with the ladies? I think you guys have given me the confidence to actually show off my scars. Let's be empowered together. Such a big moment for you. I'm actually feeling like free a bit. This is such a weird moment and I have never showed my scars to anyone apart from AJ and my family. I'm so pleased that I got out there and I am showing the world my scars. This is the first time ever and I'm feeling so positive. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.